Sunderland Independent Film Corporation presents Falling Down with Michael Douglas. I'll set the scene. He's been stuck in his car and it's right hot day, so he's got a real knack on, I'm telling you. Now listen up, he's already started a couple of rough lads on a mound somewhere near the shops. But oh no, he's going over to the local shop and the bloke in there is a well-known bloke for overcharging. Well, what is going to happen when Mr. Michael Douglas goes in this shop? Whew, it's hot. What do you got to drink in here? I'm looking drink tablets. Yeah, we'll take a little, no, tango. That'll be one pound. One pound for ten? I've only got 50p, okay? I'll take, uh, Panda Pop. Panda Pop, 70 pounds! 70 p I can get four for a pound in Landis. Oh, yeah. What's your Landis then? I'm not bothered! Okay, that's your attitude. Ha! I'm not worried about that. It'll come back in shape. Yeah, well, it's a hot day out there. How about this? No, my topic! Yeah. I'll never get shape back! <laughs> get out of here, you dumb! Here's your 25p. You're daft twat! <laughs> You're topping a right! Good luck, Mr. Michael Douglas. Good luck. Michael Douglas, sir. There goes Dr. David Banner. Running, always running. He invented a mystery potion, but got the ingredients wrong. Now the authorities, mainly the government, but also big businesses are after him and after his potion. All you can do is run and see what happens. But if he gets vexed or riled up or anyone gives him a load of lies or shite like that, he loses his rag big time. Oh no, he's going into better bake. They've got a reputation for overcharging. Hello, hello, sir. How lovely. do you do? What a lovely day outside. It's a lovely super day. Lovely day for a stroll. Oh, I should just introduce myself. I'm the baker. Are you really? Well, nice to meet you. I'm Dr. David Banner. Hello, Doctor. Anyway. Right, okay, down to business. What a lovely macaroon. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Would you like a price? Yes, please. One pound fifty, sir. One pound fifty? That's a bit steep. Well, I have to reassess now, then. Uh, how much is that lovely iced bun? The iced bun, sir, are £1.50. Another £1.50, still too steep. I can get four for a pound in Larchfield Street, of course. Oh, can you, sir? Well, why don't you go to Larchfield Street, then? Well, do you know, I think I might. <laughs> well, I'm not bothered. Well, I think you should be. Well, I'm not bothered, sir. You wouldn't like me when I get angry, you know. I don't like you already, sir. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Look what you've done now. Just get out of the shop, will you, sir? I will. What a twat. <laughs> so, there he goes, running again. Oops, looks like he's got a stitch. Not surprising, running on an empty stomach. Goodbye, Dr. David Banner, and good luck. Yeah. So that's that, that, that thing, what? That, 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 the serpent was dead. Anyway, Broadway, that's for sure. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. So we have time for Mr. Stephen Sondheim. Stephen Sondheim, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, Stephen Sondheim, ladies and gentlemen. Now, ladies and gentlemen, our next guest has just won the Eurovision Song Contest. She had a fantastic year all the way around England, Ireland, Scotland, where she's here in the studio tonight. Please welcome, for our Thursday day, my friend, Miss Mary Hopkin. Mary Hopkin! <laughs> Never lose, for we were young and sure to have our way. 